Good evening, friendos. It's time for a quest for Semi Glory uh, Legend of Zelda Link to the Past randomizers tonight. We are sitting so very, very close to a two hour average. We are a buck 47 above that. Let's see if we can't push that below. I don't have a great feeling about tonight, but then again, I never have a great feeling about a rando, anyways, so. We'll just have to see what happens. Three, two, one! Go, 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 go. Let's do this. What do we got? First chest. The power glove! Oh my goodness. That is one heck of a start right there. Hey, Jihad Jones, how you doing? Good to see you. My goodness, power glove straight out the gate. Not sure if good sign or bad. Also not sure if the sign we're carrying is good or bad. Well, it's a bad sign for that dude. Ha 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 ha. So dumb. All right, tree pull, what do we got? Ah, hearts, boo. Ba -da 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 -ba 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 -da. Uncle, what you got for us? Some bams. All right, you know, it's, it's okay to get early. Bams are good early. Excuse me, fella. What we got here? And a big old 20 there. Just some pocket change. What we got there? Nothing. Okay. Okay, well, not a terrible start. Not the most terrible start we ever could have had. Church, what you got for us today? Uh, just a small ass key. I don't need a key. I need some money, and I need a sword, and I need many, many other things. <laughs> Spend 12 hours today managing your smoker with two racks of ribs. Oh man, that sounds fucking delicious. Did you eat them yet? I hope you ate at least some of them. I hope you tasted them, because that sounds fucking phenomenal. Oh, they're gone. All right, good, 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 good. My goodness, that does sound very delicious. This crab got for us today. Just need some fivers. Excuse me. Drop more fivers for me, please. Dude, stop bopping me around. Give me the fivers. All right. That wasn't, wasn't the most lucrative uh, crab drop I've ever had. What about lumberjack? Lumberjack. Oh no! The Titans bits on lumberjack cave. Oh shit. That's not good. That means Agawan is defo required. No, oh, I don't like that. I do not like that one fucking bit here. Alright, just give me some more cash while we're fucking kicking about here. There we go. That was a more lucrative. Dang it! Well, Ego one required, so that's, what, six and a half, seven minutes just sunk right- Bird! Get the fuck out my face! Alright, small little piece of candy. And mushroom spot. Dang it. Well, I was feeling good about the seed at first, and then I saw the Titans mitts on Lumberjack Ledge, and it's just like, well, fuck me. That's not a good sign. So, we'll probably be grabbing those as soon as good prudence dictates is a good idea. <sighs> charcoal tastes amazing, but damn, it's a lot of work. Hell yeah, man. I grill the charcoal as well. And yes, I agree with that sentiment 100%. Like, I want to switch to gas, but it just tastes so good. It tastes so good. I don't know if I'd want to switch off of it. Nah. Maybe once I run a gas line out back to where I use the grill, I'll switch to gas. But probably not until then. Because I really don't want to buy a gas grill where I gotta keep swapping out propane tanks and shit like that. That just seems more hassle than it's worth. More bombs? The bug net, okay, safety item, whatever. The red meringue. And 300 roops, all right. All right, all right, all right. Another 20, all right. Oh, got, us, uh, got ourselves some pocket change here. Some good old pocket change, all right. Red meringue, bug net. <clears throat> The only trouble, I mean, charcoal's a lot of work, yeah, but I don't mind putting in the work to do it because it tastes amazing. But, kind of the only trouble with my grilling is that I can't, if I grill only for myself, it's really a waste. It's like really a waste. Ooh, we got some powder. 
Powder and bug net are good safety items. It's candy. Empty bottle? All right. Hey. All right. And then the... Oh, the hook shot. Oh, hell yeah. Okay. Powder hook shot. Excellent. Things are starting to look up a little bit. Ba -da -da -da. Ten arrow cap. Boo. All right. Well, we can hit sick kid. We gotta put ourselves a bit of busy to battle. Um, but yeah, if I grill for myself, it's kind of a waste. Because then I've got so much to eat. <laughs> Because I can't just like grill out like a, like a pound of burgers or something like that. That's just like a waste of time. So it's always got to wait for like some celebration or a get together or whatever. And it's always delicious, mind you. It's always delicious. It's always worth it. But heck. But heck. But heck. All right, Sikki, what you got for us today? Flippers. My goodness. My goodness. Heck, Rico, turn it into uh, the village of value. Some, some definition of value, I guess. Just a bunch of money. We've got a few key items. Got some, got some safety items. If we had gotten hammer right away, that would have been great. That would have given us Stark World access, even though we can't really do anything without Moon Pearl. That's right. Did you see the latest Nintendo Dream Letter? All right, what's in the library? Bomb cap in the library. Do not care. Zero percent cares are given. About race game. Race games just got some busy bands. Uh, I probably should have bought some more bombs before we go to the south. Actually, no, we're good because we got the hook shot for uh, mini landmo cave, or not mini landmo, mini moldorm. Excuse me, my boss is mixed up, y'all. You're right, I do keep my hair damn short. I just got a haircut this morning, actually. It was getting a bit much to handle, so I'm like, you know what, fuck this. I'm gonna go get it cut. And so I did. I'm so good at telling stories. <laughs> Piece of candy. Jarhead, oh no. No, there's still hair up there. Jarhead would be like completely buzzed gone. I don't like that. I don't like the prospect of getting sunburned on the top of my skull. That's not something I'll do. My brother does that. I don't do that. Nothing but a fiver under the water there. Nope, no skull burns for me. No skull burns for me. I've had that a couple times when I got it like really uber short and I'm like, you know what? There's a way I can avoid this. <laughs> And so I did. Ooh, nice full magic. Dude, stop moving around. Hey! Oi! Oi! Oh, shit. <laughs> Got a little too excited. There we go. Yeah, we'll grab that. Why not? Bow, bow. Ba, 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 bum, ba, bum, ba, bum, ba, bum, Oh, Samaria! Shit. Some, some 20s, some 20s. The flute and a piece of candy. Dang. We got ourselves some heckin' good value here. I think we will check... Oh, anyway. We will check uh, Ice Rod Cave real quick. And then we're gonna go activate that flute. Because I love me some fast travel. It's all good. Good shit. We don't quite have the money for Zora just yet. But as soon as we get that, we'll probably be heading up there. Either that or and and or moon. Oh, I guess we don't even need moon pearl really. Just thinking about uh, about the water walking glitch. We don't need to do that because we've actually got flippers. Shadurp a derp. All right, what do we got? Ah, busy bambos. All right. You know what? No, we're not gonna do. I'm not gonna activate the flute just yet. We're gonna go uh, backside escape. So we got one bomb left. Do it. One bomb left to take care of business here. Oh, 
Man, they're being real stingy on the bomb drops, too. All we've got was their those two three packs. Ooh, blue mail, burrito, and a piece of candy. All right, well, blue mail's, blue mail's good. That's real nice to have. All right, let's go get that flute a rolling here. Give me some fast travel. Is this repeating music? I think this is on repeat. <laughs> it's like, this sounds real familiar. We're gonna turn off repeat, there we go. And move to the next one, please. I don't know why I didn't notice that sooner. Oops. I figured random was playing with me a little bit. Be like, hey, fucko, here's that song that sounds a lot like the other song. All right, well, just in time for our national anthem, please rise. <laughs> All right, we've got some choices to make. I'm thinking front side escape or desert, just to get that knocked out. Maybe Sahash and Easter. That seems like a good play. We don't have the materials to go take care of Aga 1, which is probably okay at this point. Oh wait, I don't have a bomb to go to Agonis Cave. Shit, that was dumb. I'm gonna go buy some first. Got the money. We'll uh, put us a little bit uh, outside of Zora's range a little bit more here, but that's fine. All right, now. I just wanna get this one out of the way. Just in case it's like the lamp or a sword or something. Pissed at myself later on. Ow, stop it. Ah. Oh, we're picking up Bombos too, I think, right? Burda, 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 burda. Oh, actually, I don't want to do frontside escape yet because, uh, just put a big old 20. Uh, because we don't have really a reliable weapon except the hook shot. And not really enough bombs to carry us through, so... I guess we'll leave that for now. So Sahash seems like the better play then. Sahash and Eastern. Total of uh, six items. Well, guaranteed five. Up to six, depending on where they are placed within the dungeon. Since we do not have a Zebo to take care of Armos. Alright, old man. It's in the back room. Ten arrows, big ol' 20, and a big ol' 300. Okay, well that puts us to... That puts us to Zora now. That's good. That's actually really solid. Uh, let's not do that yet, though. Eastern is a call in our names. Although the Zora play right now would get us four-ish items. Four items. Plus Hobo would be five. We can do East Side Death Mountain too, because we've got the hook shot and the flute. All right, we got we got lots of options, lots of options. Another good bomb pickup, thank you. Bum 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 bum. Big ass key right away. All right. We have to deal with a few dark rooms. These are these are easy, easy ones. Well, sort of easy. I, I guess we don't really need to deal with the dark room on the way to Armos, which is good. That one's the, probably the most painful one in here. 
since we got no arrows. We don't need to worry. Hey, there's a fancy looking thing. Our first sword. 15 minutes in. <laughs> still going on about the hair? No, that was like five minutes ago. Why would I still be going on about the hair? <laughs> oh boy. Ah, I fucked it up. That's right. I've only gotten the, the, the two skeleton trick once. Burrito there. Alright, well we've got... Probably a 50-50 shot at this point of being able to get all three items out of here. And we will not be able to, because that will leave us just the one here. the one all the way around the block. Uh, doorway, thank you. Ow. Uh, I was supposed to hit something there. There it is. <laughs> Not, not the best dark room we've ever had. That's okay. Uh, oh, we're not going to be able to do the damage boost for this, though. Do not have enough health. That's all right. Uh-oh. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Stop it. Ah. Ow, stop. God, that was... Actually, you know, maybe doing a, a death warp out of here is, isn't the worst idea. Alright, so that was kind of worthless. Just a, uh, just a small piece of candy there. Hmm. So now, I feel like we should do probably Zora. Or, shit, that was the wrong place to go. That'll get us four. Five if you include Hobo. Which I am going to include Hobo. Then I guess we can bust a move on up to Death Mountain. That'll get us, let's see, seven plus one, two if we include Old Man. A lot. Let's just say it's a lot. Not quite double digits. We can't get the hair. All right, so just a big old 20 on uh, Island. Really early flippers. Who had the flippers? I think uh, a sick kid had flippers, right? What we got there? Oh, another sword! Fucking sick! Man, Hobo. Hold on to some good shit for us. Excellent. Fucking excellent. Enough money for Zora, and we should have enough money for everything else here, I think. That will give us, what, 242 left? That's a comfortable amount. Oh, there's the boots. There's the boots. The waterfall. Excellent. Okay, well, despite this being Mega One Required C. It's not turning out too poorly right now. Although, we could always get dicked about. Could always get dicked about by a, a mid or a late game item really hiding pretty good from us. We haven't even checked the map here. Crystal, crystal, crystal. Okay. All right, King Ripoff, what you got? What are, what are we paying a king's ransom for here? 
It was just a piece of candy. Oh, white. Nice. 10% return. Oh, shit. What was on the ledge? I think it was just a piece of candy, right? Do not recall. We're gonna check it. So I got the boots real quick. May as well pick it up if it is, yeah. Since we're only sitting at five hearts, it's probably worth it. Alright, so not bad. Not a bad Zora play. At least getting the boots out of here. I will do front side escape. Nah, uh, you know what? No, I changed my mind. We're not doing front side escape. <laughs> I'd really like to knock out the uh, darkroom chest right away if we can. Make sure we get the old man out of here first. A little bit of a sequence break, so... Oh, whoopsie, nice. I just kept going. So if this does turn into an important item, we're going to have to take that into account when we try to plan out the rest of our route here. No, well, just bombs. You know what? That's okay. That's okay. So we can see what's on top of Spec Rock. We can't get it, but we can get whatever's inside if it's worth it. It's just a piece of candy up top. But inside, just some arrow cap inside. Okay. So kind of worthless. Kind of worthless so far. Seven items for us. Plus, we can check what's on the island. It's candy. Big old 20. Alright, a lot of red so far. If we're gonna keep the trend of red. I'd like to see the red mail, please. Roops. 20 roops. Well. Definitely keeping the red theme. <laughs> Are these all going to be red items? There's a lamp and some busy bands. Nice. All right. Well, we did the appropriate thing in holding off on uh, front side escape. Since we now have the lamp to check the dark chest. Awesome. Alright, so we just, now we just got Spiral Cave, and we can check the island while we're here. So grab a backup fairy while we're here, too. Alright, so nothing but that. Alright, that was, what, a 10 bomb cap, I think? Not exactly worth it. there. Alright, well, I'm gonna flute out rather than S and Q, because I think it's marginally faster. Alright, this doesn't leave us a whole lot of options. Just four items here, and then one through Bonk Rocks. So we can't get into any other dungeons. We've already taken what we could out of Eastern. Oh, except now we do have the, uh, 
do have the gear to do an Ega play. Ega one, since he is guarding the Titan's mid. So, uh, that's probably going to be our next stop <laughs> after all this is said and done. Oh, nice hammer. Fucking beautiful. I don't think we needed that key. Probably could have just kept on rolling. So now we've got a uh, level two sword to get through the little energy bat thing. Get up to the tower, and we've got the boots to bust down the tree to get the to get the uh, uh, second lift upgrade. So far, pretty pathetic items. One left. We're gonna try to set up and actually properly do the death warp out of here. I should do well enough. Oh, and then there's the moon pearl. My goodness. All right. Well, we can get to Dark World without Ega One, but we need those Titan's Myths. Oh, damn it! I forgot I had a fairy. Fuck. Ah, sh. Dang it. Then I go and do some dumb bullshit like that. Fuck. <laughs> All right. Well, let's do Bonkrogs first then. Whoops. <laughs> Dang it. I knew there was something just too perfect about that. Oh, and the hammer. That's right, we did get the hammer out of escape. The five are there. Now we've got Dark World access, but I need to go fucking do Ega one anyways. Alright, I suppose we should do Dark Chest first. Just in case it is something of critical value. Like, oh, I don't know, the mirror. Fire rod. Let us awaken together. Oh, now we can get to Batman, too. That's right, because I've got the powder. Alright, what do we got? Was it worth the trip? Uh, <laughs> maybe, maybe not. But at least now we can route that in with the rest of it. Well, let's just go knock Ega 1 out of this here. Before we head on over to Dark World, excuse me, that's places to be. You're in the way. Oh, I was hoping that extra key would carry over here. Nice.
proper route through here. Double back on myself ten different times. Well, we really don't need to die here since I lost my uh, backup fairy because I'm an idiot. <laughs> oh, crap. Uh, let's not take a dumb death here, please. Just in case. Shit, let's go. Let's fucking go. How many blue balls you give us this time around? Well, there's one. Great. Starting starting strong right out the gate. Thanks, bro. Two, great, awesome, perfect. There's three, all right, great. If you turn this into a three cycle, I'm gonna be very unhappy. God damn it. <laughs> awesome. What a shit. God, I hate this guy so much. Alright, well, it wasn't the worst it could have been, but still. Eat a shit, Ega One. Got literacy on the pyramid, huh? Okay. I guess that's that's all right. I mean, it's not great. Uh, huh. So what? Where? Where does that put us in terms of the best route now? Probably Dark World by a Village of Outcasts. Got a, a fair amount of gear. Oh wait, uh, I actually want to go get <laughs> go get the Titans bits first. Derp. Since we did all that work explicitly for this.
Dude, stop. Stupid fucking bits on... <laughs> on Lumberjack Ledge. Give me a gosh dang break. Seven minutes, I'll never get back. Well, the important thing is we've had it. We have it. We do the stupid wrap around to get into Dark World, we can just go straight in. Plus, since we've got hammer and powder and all of that good stuff, the Dark World fetch questies will be real easy. Real easy to route in. Oh, man, look at this. Yikes. All right, so fire is green. Got Skull Woods and Thieves Town is the others. Ice is the other five sixer. Uh, I don't know how I feel about that. That seems kind of silly. But, I mean, we're not missing a whole heck of a lot in terms of go mode items. Really. In bow, the two rods, and a mirror, I think. So we're only four items off, but those could be pretty much anywhere. I don't know if we'll go into Skullwood. Or not, uh, we probably won't go into Skullwoods at all. I'm not, I don't know if I want to go into Thieves Town. Although, given the shit that we've get, gotten so far out of Village of Outcasts, it's probably not a bad player. Not a bad player. Check Bumper Cave right quick before we get back down to it. Piece of candy, I think? Yeah, alright. <laughs> wow. Seeing Bolt there. Trying to get to me. Oh, we already checked Sea House, derp. What happens when I don't mark shit off when I'm done with it? Uh, I think we'll leave Thieves Town out of this for now. Four items is tempting, but we've got a lot to do yet before we probably even go into there. Oh, except we do not have mirrors, so this overworld routing is going to be a bit painful. Since we're going to have to S and Q out twice to take care of it. Once for the blackjack, or blackjack, nice. Once for the blacksmith and once for the purple chest. Alright, well at least it was a quick dig. But, I suppose at the very least, when we do s and out to deposit the blacksmith, we can get a uh, bat cave. Get a little Batman out of here. But in the meantime, on a little frog world tour here. Pipe cave, old stumpy. That'll probably be it for now. We could go up and do Hera, which is the five sixer that'll get us our first crystal plus uh, Dark Side Death Mountain, which is another 
seven items, so let's say. All right, we're getting healthy before we're even diving into anything. That's fine. Single push bomb there. Let's see what happens. There's a vanilla three hundo for you. What else we got? Another heart container, baby's first shield, it's candy, and another fairy bottle. You know what? Just a little bit of backup. Not quite the hype we were looking for. But hey, it's I. It's I. Alright, let's get on out of here. Bum 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 ba da da. Bum 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 bottom bum bum bottom Bum 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 bottom bum 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 Oopsie. <laughs> Yeah. Making money over here, you fucking counterfeiters. Don't you do the dig spot, too. Big ass knife in the ground. Gonna hurt you. <laughs> what we got here? Ah, come on. kind of a bust but we got a dig spot to do yet and then I think we'll flute up to mountain get here all taken care of and then hit up dark side death of mountain and we'll be back to choosing our routes oh we could technically do uh, ice palace oh I don't well only bombos makes it kind of a pain in the butt but hey, at least we got a hook shot. Is it it's candy, all right, whatever. Here. Shit. <laughs> oh, I like that. I like that a lot. Squirrels, for fuck's sake, can you not get in my way every goddamn time? Uh, wait, what am I doing? I gotta go this way. I gotta go around, since I don't have the mirror. Check ether tab too, since we've got literacy. Literacy is on our side. Learn to read, kids. It's good for you. Ah, 
Well, literacy only gets you 50 bucks. Let that be a lesson to everybody. Single-ass roof in the basement. the last item isn't in the basement here. That would be dumb. Last item. Excellent. Quick in, quick out. I like that. Makes Hera very, very nice. I mean, no good items. Which would have been even better. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> Which would have been even better, to be honest with you, but hey. A real quick, real quick crystal. So I don't fall down like a big dumb idiot all the time. There we go. Second time's always the charm. That's how that saying goes, right? Fucking Wormulon, get out of here. Nice. Corner cover there. Come on, come on. Come get some. Hey, come get it, you fuck. There you go. Good boy. Alright, suck shit, Wormulon. That is good for burrito or a compass, and our first crystal. One of the five sixers. So, that takes care of the remainder of Light Side Death Mountain, I guess. Um, besides Mimic Cave, maybe. Oh, fucking really? Dick squirrel. Tiniest ass place for it to get stuck. Choose that one. is here. If it's Bombos, that's sort of good. It is. Alright, let's just open it up over here then. It does let us check, I want to say, maybe three items? Three chests in here right away? Or no. Actually, just one. So we don't have the fire rod yet. God damn it. I fall the exact wrong place. Great, awesome. Got the longest ass way around now, too. This is not that bad. Scan it. Alright, well, the sword in and of itself is fine. Just got the super bunny chests, and then we'll be on our way. We're gonna bother with the uh, spike cave just yet, even though we do have the health to kind of handle it. I guess next play is Ice Palace. Either Ice Palace, since we can complete it, it's a crystal dungeon, etc.
It's got three items, and it's the other five sixer. Even though I don't like not having like a good deal of magic for it, we don't have half magic. We've only got bombos, not fire rod. So we're already looking kind of slim there, but I think we should be able to still manage this without any issue. Even though if we route properly through this, I don't think magic will be a problem. So maybe I should have done the smart thing and grabbed a potion before we came in here. Oh well. It's too late. As the kids say, it is too late. Realistically, I think we only need two more casts of Bombos, which is perfect, because that's all we've got. All we got the magic for. So we get a good magic drop here somewhere. Let's see. Ah, uh, the burrito! Really go for a burrito right now myself. But no, we gotta do this. We gotta finish the random. Drops from any of you fucks? No, of course not. How silly. Should be close enough. Yeah. Alright. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Every game's gotta have a conveyor belt. Just wouldn't be. Wouldn't be a true Vigi game without. Some manner of conveyor belt. There we go. First try. Serve my health a little bit here, even though I've got two backup fairies, I'd rather not burn them if we don't need to. small keys, so I can't do the different route I was thinking of. So we'll just do the normal thing. Should be take that much longer. There's one item. Exactly ideal. a very fast room. What am I forgetting? <laughs> your derp a derp. You're forgetting that, idiot. Oh, oh, easy. See? Second item. Hmm, not looking good for Ice Palace giving us uh, actually useful items here. Thank you. 
fuck's sake, just get the block. Ugh. Everything just floats right in the way. Nice. Solid magic jar. I mean, I guess it really doesn't matter at this point. I only need one cast of Bombos to bust, uh, what's his face, uh, Cold Stare out. And that's it. That's all we need to care about, really. and uh, one item left here. Bizzy bam! So, all right, well, that's kind of a bust on Ice Palace items. Uh, I hope this is the right way to go. Really not sure at this point, <laughs> like where this is gonna lead me. Oh, okay, this is oh, this is perfect actually, I think. Nope, that I think I just did, I did a dumb there. I should have gone around. Should've gone back to the left. Oh well, too late. Yeah, this is just gonna take me back over here. Never mind, I'm an idiot. Well, this place as well as I probably should. Well, the good news is this is another crystal dungeon. The better news is this is the other five sixer. So we get the two, um, we get the two, uh, double chested fairy chests. And the best news about all that is we've got the shortcut for it because we had to do egg one. So I guess it kind of all worked out in a weird, morbid, twisted sense of things. Jeez, these guys still do, like, fucking four hearts. That's right. We've got two fairies, so I'm pretty sure we can still manage this. Or no, three hearts, because I've got blue mail. I think it would be four hearts if I only had the green mail. Oh, jeez, no. No need to burn our second fairy if we don't need to. Never mind. <laughs> So where do we go next now? I guess we go check out Meyer. Ugh. Really didn't lead us to any new spots. We can oh we can go do desert. We can go do desert and go do uh, double chested fairy. So let's go do desert first. Uh, we'll have to approach from the front because I don't have the mirror. At least we can flute over there. Hey, Sonic Shard, how you doing? Good to see you. 
Alright, we've got all the gear to take care of death. It's another crystal. Two items that possibly put us on a different path. Ba 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 do do early big key ba 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 da ba 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 small key on the torch hmm. not sure how I feel about this ba 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 in the big chest. At least we got the boots. This would be a big pain in the ass if we didn't have the boots. Quest that I don't want to deal with. Ouch. And a piece of candy. Alright, well. <laughs> Not exactly the thing I wanted to see there. But whatever. Ugh. At least we've got the flute. We can go turn in the mushroom real quick. And then we'll probably check double chested fairy and then I can oh come on man. And then we can probably dip into Thieves Town. I do not relish going into Mire. We can even get into Mire. And I relish even less actually doing Mire. Since it's a pendant. And not even the green pendant. Oh wait, no, Mire is the green pendant. Never mind. That makes it slightly less of a pain in the butt. Anyway, how am I doing? I'm doing alright. Doing okay. It's been a good Saturday. Got to sleep in, got a haircut, got a bunch of stuff cleaned up, got some bidges posted. It was a good Saturday. All things considered, it's a very good Saturday. I wish I could have more like this one. Like, I need like a decade's worth of Saturdays. That would be just the best. But, uh, you know, the world ain't gonna give me that, so I'll take good Saturdays as they come. Uh, we do have a lamp. Alright, unfortunately we do not have fire rod or the bow, so... This will be a fun landmo fight. We do have tempered. Tempered sword, at least. So, that's good. Got that going for us. Ah, short hop. Dirty ass three cycle. That'll be the burrito, or the compass, I'm sorry. We already got the burrito. But there's crystal three, and we're gaining times, we're gaining some time back, so whatever. I'm gonna complain about it. Oh boy. Okay, um, well. I guess turn in the mushroom and then hit double chested fairy. It's the best we got. I don't even know what would be best for us progression wise. A bow would be nice. Oh, uh, 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 while we're here. <laughs> while we're here and we've got tons of money, let's get us some potions. Okay, so Mushroom was a bust. Uh, let's flute on down and go back to Dark World. Or, or no, 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 this is good, this is good. Uh, we could do Purple Chest as well, but that's a fucking... That's a heck of a slog for one item. not gonna worry about that for now. <sighs> I think if this doesn't lead to anything good, our next best bet is Thieves Town. 
It's at least four items, even if it is a pendant. Oh, wait, we can't take the shortcut because I don't have uh, the mirror. Dang it. <laughs> Never mind, I was all happy that we had it worked out, but no, nope, I'm missing one key detail there. Strict policy against pendant dungeons is gonna bite me on this one. <laughs> Alright, here's our chance. Two chances here. Huh? Eh? Eh? Huh? Ah! <laughs> Shit, that didn't work out at all. Uh. Uh, I guess Meyer. We can do the Meyer shed and check that we can actually get into Meyer. Mark Ether there. I guess then it's time for Thieves Town. Oh, whoops. Dang it. For Meyer, we need ether for Meyer, which we have, so we could go in there if we wanted to. <coughs> I really don't want to. Ah, really? Two big 20s in Meyer Shed? Fuck off with that. I guess since we're here, we may as well do it. The only reason I don't like this, well, besides it being a pendant dungeon, is that we don't have the bow, so Vitrius is going to be a pain in the ass, and we don't have either Kane of Brian or Magic Cape to make that fight a little bit easier if we get scared. So, I guess we'll just pop in. Usually Meyer doesn't take that long. That's not that big a deal. clearing this anyways because of the green pendant awaiting us at the end. And dang, if this was, uh, if we were go-moding Meyer for here, for like crystal or something, that would be the best possible situation. We got a big key immediately. Gosh dang it. Oh, we don't have fire rods, so this is going to be a slowest-ass thing in the world through these other torches. Great. <laughs> Fucking great. Alright, Meyer is not fun. Not a good dungeon. I 
do this quick enough? All right, good. Ugh. Okay. Oh, goody. Worthless items. <laughs> I really don't need any more money, please. Please give me something of value, something to justify us coming in here. Good news is we don't have to think about going to get that other chest. Well, there are two chests, I guess, right? Yeah, because one of them's gonna be a small key, and one of them's gonna be the compass. <sighs> so there's that, I suppose. But we're gonna finish this off anyways, since Green Pendant gives us one more item through Sahashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashashash
So that was valuable. That was a valuable thing to do. Because we need the mirror for Swamp, and Swamp is a fucking crystal. Okay, all right, I feel better about that now. Wasn't a complete giant waste of time. Huh, okay. Okay then. Uh, oh, oh, ha. Fucking whatever. I swear that screen transition point is way too generous. This also makes the purple chest fetch quests a little bit nicer. Unless we can knock out Bombos and Cave South of Grove right away. Surprised I remembered where we were in the song there. Oopsie. That's the wrong way to toss that motherfucker. Big ol' 20! Thanks, Swamp Alice, for the money. Really needed it. do not need any more rupees, please and thanks. We are good. Consider us perfectly fine with our rupee count. Spiked again, aren't I? Look out! Uh, ow! <laughs> Dang it. Uh, that's alright, I've got a fairy and a blue potion, I think, so we're good. there. Not yet. I had to remember to flip that switch, right? It's back to orange? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Okay. Bum, bum, ba, ba, da, ba. Ouch. Bum, ba, ba, da, ba. Bum, bum, ba, ba, da, ba. Ah, the bloomerang. No. 
That's not the thing I need. I need the rods and the bow. Dang it. Oh, man. We are burning through item chances here, left and right, and they're not even useful. That's silly. <laughs> Shit. I don't even have the big key yet, do I? Nope. Okay, well... Just hoping that we don't ouch. We don't need to come back in to get the last item. These last two chests could be the last two items. That would be really fucking fine and awesome. That would be really fine and awesome at this point. Eh? Okay. Ah, they were, and there was nothing but rupees. What the hell, man? What the hell? I think five of the six were rupees. That's ridiculous. That's gosh dang ridiculous, Swamp Palace. What are you doing? So again, that gives us no progression items, no nothing to get us anywhere else. Ugh, what a mess. Hey, Game Over, how you doing? <laughs> Couch Cash OP, right? Almost had a thousand Gs here. Or, well, a thousand rupees, I guess. Most of which I don't need. I could stand to get probably one more backup potion, that'd probably be a, a not terrible idea. Oh, excuse me. Ugh. Ah, eat shit, Argus. At least gets us crystal four. But... Now, that leaves us at the mercy of any one of these fetch quest items, plus whatever could be, oops, forgot to mark off Sahash, whatever could be in Thieves Town. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, man. Not happy with the way this is going so far. I mean, we had a pretty good start with items and such, but now it's just being, like, all stupid and dumb and boy, garbage like that. Uh, what did I come to Kagariko for? Purple chest. Purple chest. Oh, well, purple chest and... Oops. Eh, we'll leave Cape North of Graveyard for now. We'll do purple chest, Cape South of Grove, and Bombos, I think. Oh, and whatever else is there. Whatever else I'm thinking of there. Oh, that's Checkerboard Cave. Never mind. We'll have to get that separately. Not everyone can run can be a winner. That's right. That's right. I'd prefer a few more winners, but uh, RNG has not seen fit to grant that to us today. But ba, ba da da da. Oops, I left the chest behind because I ran like a doofus. Our fetch quests good. Uh. I don't know. That's got kind of a complicated answer. Simply because I think fetch quests can be done well, but I don't know if they're objectively good. If they're put in place simply to extend the length of a game, it's not good. If they're put in place as maybe an optional portion to expand on the lore of a game, that could be good. If they're put in place in, like, a very difficult fashion to get you some, like, OP item or whatever, that could also be good depending on how people like to play. I don't know. There's a lot of different answers to that one. Like me, I'm, I'm very much on board with kind of high skill type stuff. 
So like, if you make a fetch quest difficult to do, difficult to pull off well, like, I'd, I'd call that fun in a sense, but it better have a damn good payoff at the end, too, you know? Risk reward, that sort of thing. Oh, could we even pop into... We could pop into the pod if we wanted to here. Oh, there's the arrow of destiny. All right, well, run is valid, at least. <laughs> Shit. Thanks for nothing, purple chest. Gary, you gotta pack something better than a gosh dang arrow in your lunch, please. Oi. Oi. Oh, there's the silvers. Okay. <laughs> that is fine right there. That is perfectly okay with us. Silvers are good. Silvers are real nice. Oh, well, that was dumb. Silvers we like to see, so no silverless Ganon today. At least on this run. And also no spin strats Ganon since we've already got Tempered Sword. So, okay, alright. That's fine. That's fine and good. You want to fetch quest? Probably unlock item upgrades. Okay. Optional. All right. All right. That's fine. Oh my goodness. It's the fucking fire rod. Hello. Hello, sweet thing. Okay. That's better. That's one more item closer to go mode. I think we just need ice rod and we'll be good to go. Oh, and bow. We need the bow as well. All right. I will say, if you do put fetch quests in, uh, don't make it like, oh, I need five of X number of item that only these types of enemies drop or something like that. That's some garbage. Oops, what am I doing? I'm going the wrong way. That's what I'm doing. Flapping my gums and going the wrong way. Because fetch quests like that are just dumb. Like, I don't care what's at the end of those. It's a fucking slog. And really, it's just put there to extend the length of the game. So don't do that type of fetch quest. Those are those are those are wrong. Those are objectively bad. <laughs> okay, so we've got Cave North of Grove and we've got or not North of Grove. Uh Cave North of Graveyard and Catfish. Before we start dipping into more pendant dungeons. Or we can take a risk and dip into pod right away. One guy needs a thing, you gotta take it from guy one to guy two. Okay, that's... That's reasonable if it kind of works within the story. Because I've seen some real stinkers where... They'll have a fetch quest like that, but it'll be like a guy across town or some garbage, and they'd never adequately explain why the first dude can't just go to the second dude himself. That damn fucking big 20. Like, see, that shit to me is kind of egregious and dumb. Like, whenever you're dealing with a, like, a more story-based game or lore-based game or whatever, there are a lot of things you can get away with only if you work it into being relevant and, uh, and doable within the story, you know? Ow, jeez, this dude still do two hearts with blue mail? Fuck. Because if it's ever beyond beyond the story, like there's no good explanation or it's super flimsy or whatever, that's just dumb bullshit. Right? You don't want to put that stuff in. But hey, going going back to kind of the original question, our, our fetch quest good. They that it's yes with an if. Like a big ass if. But then again, that's all gonna be kind of opinion based, so. Don't take the stuff that I say is true. Oh, Kane of Brian, alright. Put Spike Cave on the map. Alright, well. I don't know if I like this. I don't know if I like how this is shaping up. They're gonna make me run do the whole run around for the bow and the ice rod. 
but I'm gonna take a risk and go straight to pod. We got everything but the bow, and we should be able to get everything but one item without it. <laughs> Alright, you know what? That's, that's fair. That's fair. That's fair. I, I will see I will say um, that it seems like it's harder to get fetch quests right than it is to get them wrong. But I, I think I'm probably a pretty hard person to please on that front. Just because as soon as there's even a whiff of a fetch quest, I'm like, oh good lord, here we go. There are some times I've been pleasantly surprised, admittedly, but way more often it's been disappointing. So I don't know. Wait, wait against what you want to do. What are you, what are you trying to do? What story are you trying to tell? And all that sort of stuff. There are places where it makes sense. There are places where it's the only way to do things. But by and large, I think, uh, I think it's kind of lazy design. It's a small key! Oh shit, I don't have the bow. I can't... I can't do it this way. Well, I'm an idiot. Oh, unless... <laughs> okay, alright. Here's the thing we're gonna try to do. I'm gonna waste my potion here. Yeah, this will be so killer if it works. I have no idea what the setup is for this, by the way. But I think before it locks in, so it's like right here, I wanna say? I'm gonna see if this works. That'd be probably pretty killer if this does. Nah, I fucked it up. Anyways, the, the deal behind this is if you trigger a potion like right before the screen hitches in, it won't lock in the room. Ah, I can't even explain it. Never mind. I'm not even going to try to explain it because I'm, I'm going to get myself twisted around a little bit. Um, but the, the gist of it is you can uh, make that door in that room that I was just in open without killing the enemies, which I need the bow to do. So since I don't have the bow, I in theory could have done that correctly in so much as getting through that room without having the item I need to clear that room. It's a small key. But I fucked it up, so can't do that. Can't do that anymore. This is probably gonna be a small key as well, right? Oh, no, it's the big key. Vanilla big key, what the hell? I thought this was rando. <laughs> so dumb. How about a small key here? Yeah, all right. Looking good. Looking real nice. Um, I think we had that thing aligned, right? It still had the, 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 the blue blocks. Escort quests have probably done bother you way more. Eh, I can see that. I can see that. I think escort quests are kind of dumb as well. But, I don't know. I'm just not a big fan of shit that wastes my time. That's probably my be all end all to a lot of this stuff. Another small key! It's like, what, four of them? That's four of the six that are in here? Hey, there's an ice rod! How about a bow? <laughs> How about a bow on top of everything? Alright, well that's the first real item we've got, so... We are now one item away from go mode. Eh? So if we get the bow now, we are we are good to go. Uh, we can finish this one and then do the rest. Uh, that's a bomb cap. That's not what I'm looking for. Some 
blue or green goo rather. Running out, running out of chances here. Uh, do I have the big key? I do, right? Yeah, it's the first thing I get. Ah! <laughs> Not looking good. Got one more chance at this, really. this run it's the bow being the elusive bitch here although the ice rod was kind of elusive too here's hoping bow please bow please bow please dang it piece of candy all right well shit well where does that put us i guess that puts us up to t rock if i want to continue to avoid uh thieves town like the plague which I kind of do because pendant worthless. The rock, please. Thank you. That empty potion or empty bottle now. Huh? <laughs> da -da 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 -da. Make it so people enjoy interacting with the NPCs. All right. Good. Good. That's, uh, that's a good goal to have. All interactions exchange player black, yep, yeah, okay. It's good too. I mean I think as as far as narrative based stuff goes, which it sounds like you're kinda of doing partially, um, good writing will definitely take you further than a good fetch quest. Hey, there's shield number dose. But I'm sure you already did that. Like, I've had one, maybe two cases uh, where there was a bullshit fetch quest, and I didn't know it was bullshit at the time, even though I kind of had a feeling, but it was saved by some good-ass writing. Like, it was funny, it was clever, it was smart, whatever. Fetch quest turned out to be bunk, but the writing was fucking incredible. So it was like, it was kind of okay at that point. Hey, Omega Weapon, how you doing? Good to see you. I'm trying to remember what game that was. Can't remember it now. Choppy champs. What are they doing in here? This is the wrong series for them. What are they thinking? Took the wrong pipe. <laughs> so is the chance of. Alright, let, let, let me read this sequence because I'm, I'm pretty sure I missed some context here. Witcher 3, okay. Let's put some work into the story. Yeah, I've heard good things about it. 
a chance of a fetch quest leading to sex. Okay, that makes more sense now. I'm like, whoa, Jesus. Wow, let's tap the brakes on that one a little bit. Oh my goodness. That was the compass, wasn't it? That was dumb. That was real dumb and a waste of time. <laughs> Well, I think sub two is dead at this point. It was probably dead like 10 minutes ago, but can't really do much about it now. Ah, fucked it up. Fucked it up. Ow, stop. Jesus, it's painful. Ow, stop the fireballs, please. Ooh, we are out of magic. I hope there's a small magic thing going here somewhere. Ah, good. So we need at least one to get across the gap. Maybe Mimic Cave will be fun and happy and give us the bow. No, it'll give us the red mail though, okay. That's fine, I guess. It's not the last item for Go Mode, but it's something. It's a small key! What happened if I used your mirror where there was no floor? Would you just fallen off? Uh, no, it would have just warped me back. Like, if you warp onto the sides of cliffs or, uh, into pretty much any tile where you're not supposed to be, it'll just warp you back immediately. Good little safeguard they put in there. Space and LTP, what's the tier of rewards from chest and normal playthrough like from worst to best? How'd you rate different rewards? Well, probably anything that's not a usable item, I would say, is pretty shitty. Although, when you need money, getting a big three hundo or something like that is good. Um, if you're going for 100%, obviously, pieces of candy, are, I'm sorry, pieces of heart are fine and cool. Um, but other than that, it's pretty much just usable items. <laughs> this is a butter sword mad and everything else. I mean, you're not wrong. You're absolutely not wrong. Do I have a potion, by the way? I have a green potion. That's, you know, that's not bad. That's not a bad thing to have here. Ouch. Just like it as I get my face burned off by lasers. Ouch. Hey, there's another 50 roops. <laughs> Alright, I'd, I'd rather burn my uh, fairy. Oh, there's the bow! We're in go mode! <laughs> Finally! <laughs> Alright. Jesus. Final fucking E. Alright, good. This won't be a giant ass flaming pile of garbage anymore. This will be the last key, I bet. Yay! <laughs> yeah, we're making it through. Okay, well, fuck the rest of this seed. So uh, I was right not to go into Thieves Town. How about that? How about that? Probably the only time I'll ever make the right choice in not going into Thieves Town. 
Let's see, what do we got? We got tempered. So we're gonna have to be a little careful with magic usage. Power upgrades, usable items, health extensions, count cash, temporary bonus. Yeah, that's a pretty good hierarchy, I'd say. I missed the it's like the two-frame window to open the menu while he was exploding there. Ah, you fucko. Yeah, each- oh! Oh, that's right, because I didn't get a double spin on that. Alright, eat shit, Trinex! That's Crystal 5. Ah, oh, the Butter Sword! <laughs> Damn! T-Rock. Bring in the value. Bring in the value super hard. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. Holy shit. Excellent. I stopped the timer. This run is complete. No, it's not. Unfortunately, we have to kill the big pig first. The big pig must be killed before this run can be considered truly complete. Truly finished. Well, at least we'll have, like, real quick runs uh, through the rest of Pod and Eastern, since we've already fucking gotten everything else in them. Well, besides one item for Pod, but we will still need to find a small key, which sucks, but hey, that's how she goes sometimes. Dang, this could have been a... Probably could have been a sub two if I was better at routing. Oh well. The good news is on the way to getting the small key will be a, a pretty quick path to the rest of the dungeon, so... I can't even be too mad about this. Ah, this Hey, <laughs> fucko, <go>, come on. <laughs> Ass. Alright, probably the, the last thing that could make our lives complete here is half magic. But the likelihood of that being here is probably pretty shitty ass slim. <clears throat> well, there's Quake, and that's the last usable item in this dungeon. Uh, please, alright, whatever. What's the normal reward for fetch quest in this? Uh, it's probably the big majority of things is, uh... Let's see. So, the big fetch quest... The biggest fetch quest in this is probably... Actually, there's not a whole lot of big fetch quests. Like, usually it's one item. Like, you've got the powder. You've got the powder for Batman. You've got the mushroom for the mushroom quest. You've got the shovel for dig spot. And that's pretty much it. Like, the rest are just kind of one-offs and not really fetch quests, necessarily. But anyways, for, uh, for powder, you get ma uh, half magic. It's pretty good. For shovel, you get flute, which is ultra good. And necessary, obviously. Uh, and usually, the rest of the one-offs are pieces of heart. <clears throat> the rest of the shit, like uh, couch cash, and rupees and shit, is just like incidental stuff you pick up on the way. You don't necessarily need to go out of your way for it, but it's just kind of sitting there. Oops, uh, hammer please. Hammer time.
Beedy be doo boo doo be dee. <laughs> Remember the big big fetch quest in Ocarina of Time is the big on sword as the final reward. Yeah. Yeah, it did. It did, and even it's a good that was a good reward. However, I'd say that's probably the biggest, like most obvious example I can give you of a fetch quest that really took too much. Like, don't get me wrong, the bigger on sword, fucking prime. But the absolute number of bullshitty things you had to do for it probably made it a bit not worth it. There's Crystal Six for us. Eat shit, uh, King Helmosaur. <clears throat> oh, and we got the last item. It was Quake. Like, not only did it have the normal fetch quest garbage where you had to take things from place to place for... I want to say like eight or nine times. It also had sections of it where it was time limited. <laughs> where you had three minutes to do one leg of the thing. Which, okay, fine, whatever. It's okay with fast travel type stuff. But no, if you tried to fast travel, it would insta-fail that par part of it. And you'd have to start over. Like, that's garbage. If you're going to put that shit in there, fucking let me skip it with the gear that I've already got. It was so dumb. Like, I've got some real strong opinions about that. My goodness. It was really terrible. Like, everybody loves Ocarina of Time and whatever, but that part of it was fucking terrible. I'll make no bones about saying that. I'll even say it again. The big-ass fetch quest in Ocarina of Time to get the bigger on sword is fucking terrible. You can quote me on that. 2018. Mr. Bond hates Ocarina of Time. <laughs> no, that's not true. I think it's a good game. I think it's a good game overall. But why is that guy not dead? I'm hitting him with butter. What a shit. Bro, fucking standing up to them butter slash is like nothing. Like, even besides the bigger on sword thing, fetch quest. Like, there was a lot of other things for that, too, right? Like, it was fetch quest the game for a big long time. Uh, let's get some more arrows. You know, I can easily pound this down in six. I'd rather have a couple left for the G Tower run. that one. Suck shit, Armos! All for an arrow cap, she thinks. Awesome. Alright, there's Crystal 7. We're off to... We're off to G-Tower. Alright! Everybody's favorite guessing game, 1 through 22. Where are we gonna find that big key? For G-Tower. Which, which one's it gonna be this time? Got a few minutes to think while we uh, cart our butts up there. Or, ooh, that's generous. I like that. I like that guess. You figure we're due, right? 11? Okay, that's not bad. That's still first half. That's still first half. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with either of those, really. Like, what I don't want is another 22, like what happened two sessions ago, I want to say. That was garbage. <laughs> that was some hot-ass trash right there. So we'll hit G Tower at about a buck fifty-five thirty. 
That puts us probably within... I want to say a 210, maybe a 212. Which is, let's be honest, not great. Not great. It's above our average of 20147, which sucks. But it's also below really terrible territory like 215, 220, 230, etc. So whatever. Alright. Should we do right side first? Let's do right side first. Ooh, nice lineup. Alright, here's one and two. So sick if there's one. Ah, the burrito! And if he's candy. Yeah. Alright, so right side first was not the play to make. Three is a small ass key, we'll take that. Alright, here's four through seven. Number four, small ass key. Number five, half magic. Hey, there we go. That's our big quality of life item there. Number six, small ass piece of candy. And number seven is arrows. Fucking lame. Like, getting arrows in a chest is like getting socks for Christmas. It's terrible. It's the worst. Like, who wants socks for Christmas? Nobody wants socks for Christmas. Nobody. I mean, actually, no, that's not true. I'd be okay with socks for Christmas, because it's, it's fucking useful. It's functional. Well, there's the fourth bottle, I think. Number eight has the fourth bottle. So, that said, like, getting arrows in a chest is fucking worse than socks for Christmas. Like, if you thought that was possible, amazing. It's worse than socks for Christmas. <laughs> oh, shit. Why did I do that? That was dumb. Need the hook shot here. Getting all loopy because it's getting late in the seed and I don't like it. Number nine. Ten arrows. God damn it. More arrows. <laughs> that son of a bitch. Oh, shit. Dang it, dang it, dang it. All right, here comes uh, 10 through 13. Still got a chance to make this first half without going for Bob's chest or Armos or something. Number 10, number 11, my goodness. Number 12, number 13. Gosh dang it. Oh no. Oh fucking no. That was dumb. All right, we've got one more chance before we have to drop down and fight Armos again. Oh no! Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> All right, number 14 is our last hope here. Small piece of candy! Dang it. Alright, well, we're fighting Armos. We didn't just do this like three minutes ago. Four or five minutes ago, whatever. Oh, I can't believe I missed that shot. That's dumb. Alright, here's 14, no, 15, 16, 17. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, oh! Right side! Shit. Oh, this isn't looking good. It's not looking great, man. It's not looking great. Should have just gone straight through right side. I don't know why I stopped the first two. Gosh dang it. If this is another 22 seed, I'm gonna be very unhappy. <laughs> like, very unhappy.
Oh. Um. Wow. I. What? I have never seen that happen. That was very fucking strange. I'll tell you what. Um. Who guessed 22 last time? Uh, Ron Klee. Ron Klee, uh, guessed the magic 22. And he felt bad about it. <laughs> As well he should. As well he should. But hey, he was right. So he won the prize. Won the prize. I'm a man of my word, after all. Alright, what is this? Like 18 or something? Small ass key. Or no. 19? Fuck if I remember. Nineteen through twenty-two coming up here. Uh, is that gonna hit? Of course it isn't. That's not gonna hit either. All right, getting getting the good things going here. <sighs> nineteen. Ah, nineteen. <laughs> okay, Let's get the fuck out of there. Yeah, had an event at E3 today, a crowd went comatose. Doesn't surprise me. Doesn't really surprise me all that much. EA is, how shall we say, not a great company. Ah. Nice run, though. Alright, pretty solid first room of gauntlet. Yeah, eat shit, Skeleton. Bullseye! Fuck you, man. <laughs> ah, yeah, from downtown. These cross court snipes. Whoa, bam! Fuck you, Skeleton. Get some. <laughs> hey man, if I'm gonna be happy about one thing this seed, it's gonna be these sick ass snipes. That's what I'm gonna that's what I'm gonna be happy about. Alright, can we make this a non-dumb landmo 2, please? <laughs> Fire! Ah tickets! <laughs> Alright, well a clean two cycle is fine too. <laughs> You gotta be happy about something in life. Pick, pick your happiness. Make your happiness. You know? Excuse me. Pardon me. Sick! Oh, I almost never get that in one. All right. Things are looking up for old Samus here. <laughs> Fucking sick, man. What if your happiness is being unhappy? Well, okay. Masochist much, but hey, no judgment. No judgment.
How do you feel about reusing bosses as enemies later on? Like as trash tier mobs or something? I mean, there's a, there's a bit of a limit on that too, right? Like if you're talking sort of boss-ish mobs instead of like true bosses, then it's kind of okay. But if it's like dungeon bosses and shit like that, that's kind of suspect. Why do I always do that? It's so dumb. Oops, why did I do that? Enough keys to just move on out. Alright, so this is looking like not a, not a two, sub 210. Oop, easy. Validation chest only had visited by him. There's six statues and worms in this game. All right, so this this reuse is fine, I think, because it's only reused once. Like it's a boss refight, and they're still considered bosses. You know, it's not like they're being used as you know low tier trash mobs now. All right, Dirk Wizard the Second, what you gonna do for us today? That is a shitty pattern. Come on, man. Ugh. Furthest apart they could possibly have been. And good, blue balls, awesome. Fucko. Oh yeah, good, let's just keep them spread out. Like a bunch of dumb idiots. Come on, man. All right, that's a little bit better at least. Ah, I fucked it up. Ouch. All right, got a double there. Oh, why do you blue ball me like that, you fuck? Ugh. That was not a good jerk was the second fight. Oh, wait a minute. We're, we still got two, two and a half minutes. If this is a really super sick Ganon fight, we might be able to pull a sub 210 here. Maybe. It's gonna be real tight if it happens. It's gonna be real tight. But we've got enough backups, we got some backup fairies, we got a green potion, we got plenty of safety going into this. Oh. Hear about encouraging thinking outside the box when there's evidence of any thinking inside it. Eh, words to live by, words to live by. Alright, we're just gonna make sure we're moving on to phase three immediately, that should do it. That should be enough for phase three, I think. That was a lot of hits. Sure is. Okay, good. Pretty quick phases here. I like this. This is this is voting what? Oh, you fucker! I was gonna teleport like fifty billion times. I did find the arrows in the light world, you shit. Oh, we're gonna get the fucking sick initial one and the torch glitch. Oh, maybe not because I'm an idiot. <laughs> Dang it. Uh, are we gonna get a, a second one off of this, do you think? Oh, just barely. Oh, oh no, and I fell! Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Oh, crap shits. Well, there goes sub 210. <sighs> you fucking serious. That is some garbo. Some real bad garbo. Although that was my fault. 100% my fault. Eh, fuck. Oh, that's right. Oh, dang it. All right, get the fuck out, get out of the way! Ugh. Ah, shit. All right, we're looking at a 202 now. Or two, 212, excuse me. Ah. All right, whatever, it's fine.
did find the arrows in the light world. Thank you. I missed it. Miss the torch glitch again. Arr, fuck. Huh? Okay, good double. Good double, at least. We're not gonna get a, a double double to finish her off, though. I can't believe I fell down. This is some dumb bullshit. <laughs> That could have been a sub 210, but I fucked it up. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Alright, 211.07. And how are we feeling? How are we feeling about a second one? We want to do a second one? Show of hands. We doing a second one tonight? 211 isn't super terrible. But it's not great. So we got a, like a wide berth to get a much better second run tonight. <sighs> okay, let's do a second one. I'm gonna go get topped off. And we'll start again in a minute. Be right back. Okie dokie. Prepare to fast forward. Whoop. Hmm. How's everybody doing tonight? Y'all having a good Saturday? Or whatever day it happens to be in your locale? The couch cast sleeps forever. Yeah, good. It can keep sleeping. Fucking couch cash. Stupid little shit. I like this song too. You got on the Discord, alright. That's good to know. I will mark you as a regular immediately then. Because that's what you are, game over. You are a regular. And I appreciate that very much. 
In a regular, regular, but still. Hey, you've been around for a long time, man. Don't sell that short. <laughs> Most folks pop in here for a night or two, and then they are gone. Never to be seen again. But that's okay. You know, whatever, whatever people want to do, it's their entertainment. They can choose how to consume it. All right, let's see what we got here. First sorted about 15 minutes in. Boots were pretty early. Flute was... I don't remember flute being that early. Was it? Might have been. Mirror was pretty late. We got Master Sword almost immediately. It's fucking great. Big key. Fucking 19. It's so garbage. That death was intentional. That was a death warp out of the dungeon. So I'm okay with that. That number is way too high. We should not be collecting that many items. 